pleasure of speaking with Dr. John Gluckman from Six Wave. How are you today? Fantastic. Nice to see you again, Tracy. And, you know, the company's name is Six Wave Innovations. And I think right off the bat, there's some issues with your company from investors because they can't believe what a wide variety of applications that you presently have. Is that correct? Yeah, yeah, we do seem to get a little bit of feedback to that end. So on this particular interview, let's talk about your gold applications, because I just find that scintillating, interesting, and I see how the entire gold industry can benefit. So why don't you explain it to our audience for us? Well, sure. So we've created an alternative to activated carbon for purification of gold in the gold mining industry. It works just as well for silver as well. It's more selective than activated carbon. It uh, can be done at significant savings. We don't have fines, so the gold mine gets to yield more gold. They get to do it with less energy consumption, which means thousands of tons of lower CO2 emissions. And of course, you know, with fuel costs skyrocketing, uh, significant reductions in the amount of fuel to be used. Uh, we just did an analysis for one of the mines that uh, we're working with and we got fantastic extraction recovery results. But along with that, we were able to demonstrate, you know, savings of, you know, five, 600 liters a day worth of, of uh, diesel fuel required to generate power just for uh, the desorption recovery of the gold. So we're really in love with it. We, we get consistently fantastic results uh, almost everywhere that we test. So let me dumb it down for our audience. You basically reduce the cost of $100 per? Per ounce. So $100 per ounce, you decrease the cost for large gold companies to produce. Is that correct? Yeah. So that comes from a combination of savings in reagents, savings in, in adsorbent materials, savings in energy, transportation costs, but also it's increased yield. So, you know, one of the elements that people don't know so much about is that carbon breaks down into fine powder and small particles. Well, all of that carbon has gold in it still because, uh, because of the way the systems are set up. Well, if you're not breaking down that material like you don't with Ixos, then you get to get all of that gold. And that's thousands of ounces per year. So everybody out there who is talking about carbon credits, global carbon credits, ESG investors, ESG funds, this, this uh, Ixos technology, is that what it's called? Correct. Allows gold companies in their community to almost, can they, can they make a pitch to an ESG fund, uh, Dr. Gluckman, with your technology? Yeah, I, I would think so. And, and we're really motivated to help provide them with the core data that they need in order to be able to uh, qualify for carbon credits uh, and to uh, provide information to the, to the relevant local communities about, you know, reduced uh, lixiviance, uh, potential to significantly reduce cyanide usage, uh, recyclable um, uh, chemicals that, uh, so they don't have to be released into, into tailings of waste. Absolutely. So you de decrease toxins as well in the extraction process. Is that correct? Yeah, we can. Okay. And this is for gold and silver. Are there any other resources that you can use the same technology, the Ixos technology? So the Ixos, you know, our technology is based on molecularly imprinted polymers. So we have to generate a specific um, adsorbent for each different metal that we want to go after. So we have been developing in the lithium space and we have some work ongoing for looking at hard rock lithium extraction using alternative lixivians and then using some of our technology for purification to get to high grade lithium carbonate and hydroxide. So that's one for sure. Uh, certainly it's applicable to other high value metals um, and certainly scarce resources. Uh, where having a very, very uh, efficient adsorbent uh, is important. Okay, but now, presently, Ixos is applicable for gold extraction technology, and you currently are working with? <laughs> yes, the answer is we're predominantly our Ixos product that's been fully commercialized, ready to be purchased and installed, is for gold and silver. 
and we are supporting a number of majors, uh, ten, uh, top 10 tier uh, mining organizations, a number of juniors, uh, and more recently, we're getting a lot of activity from uh, mine reclamation for cleaning up mercury and arsenic in mines, but also being able to extract remaining gold and also for tailings reprocessing. And there are a number of projects uh, in Canada and in, uh, on the African continent that we're, uh, we're talking about. So final question, because I know investors out there are going, okay, that sounds like something we might be able to absorb. Sounds great, a win, win, win. How are we doing for revenue? And what are we looking at for 2022? Can you talk to the numbers? Yeah, I think, you know, a number of our projects, you know, have to move through phases in gold mining through the acceptance. It usually starts with some testing that we do in our laboratories, and then we move to on-site testing. As soon as we've proven stuff in our laboratories, we start uh, collecting some revenue from the mine to go and do on-site testing, and then a pilot program, and then implementation. And so, you know, usually that period is a 12 to 15 month period, because in any adoption of new technology, the mine still needs to go through permitting activities. There's a plant that needs to be built. And so there is a, a length of time. We expect to convert several of our projects that have completed uh, initial testing into pilot phase testing in the next few months uh, with some of those rollouts still here in 2022. It sounds amazing. So what kind of sales team do you have in place for the Ixos pro, uh, technology? We're, we're, uh, we're fairly small and condensed. We are working with uh, several of the major mine engineering companies. So we have ongoing relationships with uh, SGS, for example. Uh, we had a, a long discussion today with uh, F.L. Schmidt. Um, and others. So we're getting to know ourselves in the mining community and in the mining groups that are responsible for building and deploying mines for the, for the major mining organizations. So for everybody out there who's interested in more information on Six Wave or the Ixos technology application for your gold extraction at your mine, please contact this email here. And John, thank you so much for joining us today. As always, it's a pleasure. Thanks for having me again.